Yeah, Mark, the Cherokee Nation is moving faster than most cities and counties in vaccinating their people. They're currently in their phase 2A. They've started vaccinating folks over the age of 55, along with workers critical to the tribe's function. The Cherokee Nation has distributed nearly 8,000 COVID vaccinations since the rollout. Currently, the tribe is moving into Phase 2A. It includes people over 55, teachers, food distributors, and other critical staff. So far, it's gone smooth, mindful that this you know, is the first time in history we've undertaken something like this. The method they use is to call those eligible to schedule an appointment, and it's been successful. Like anyone else giving out the vaccine, they're waiting on more doses to come in, something that would make more members of the tribe eligible to receive the vaccine. They get their doses directly from the Indian Health Services. Because I think our system has run well, but I am concerned that if the amount of vaccine doesn't keep up with how well we're doing, that we're going to see some gaps, we're going to see some slowdowns. The tribe has vaccinated about 900 Cherokee first language speakers, along with elders in the community. Protecting those first language speakers is very important for the livelihood of our language. We are already in a great effort uh, uphill at times to save the Cherokee language. Chief Hoskin added that the first language speakers can relieve some of the fear of getting the vaccine for others in the tribe. Now, when the Cherokee Nation moves into phase three, nearly every one of the tribe's members will be able to get the vaccine. Live in Tulsa, Jeff Morgan, News Channel 8.